Hey guys, uh, so our problem is that the installer, Windows 10 installer, doesn't recognize a newly inserted hard drive. And my hard drive is, uh, well, hard drive is SSD uh, M.2. However, even now I have the existing hard drive, and if I run the installer from a USB key, as you can see, it still doesn't recognize the, the existing one. This is because of the drivers that are missing and this is due to the fact that this is a new 11th generation 11th of Intel Pentium uh, processor. So that's what I can see on the uh, HP side. This is a HP uh, laptop and the new 11th generation processors apparently they don't have uh, so Windows installer doesn't have the drivers in them which means that in order to make it work we have to manually download the drivers from the manufacturer side so in this case in my case it would be from windows from from hp and yeah i just have it there on the list this is the uh, intel rapid storage technology so i'll download the driver and then put it onto the extract them onto the USB uh, key where I have the Windows 10 installation. So this is the, the file, but I want to extract all the files, which means that I have all of these files here extracted onto the main directory of the Windows uh, 10 installer of the USB. Okay, so once I do this, then I can click load the driver, browse, browse to the uh, specific folder and I think it might have to uh, try a few folders I think it was this one F6 where the drivers were and yeah that's where the, it recognizes them so you just click next proceed with the installation of the driver and after this process is complete then you can actually see your drive and you can um, start the installation of a fresh copy of Windows 10 there you go that's it yeah so prior to that regardless of which one uh, which hard drive you had inside or which version of the uh, windows 10 on your usb key none of it will be recognized uh, so it's really painful and it took me some time to figure it out but now i have and just wanted to share it with you so hope this would be of some help thanks